How's it going guys? I'm back at it again in here for the video for you guys for today. And in today's video, I do have somewhat of a day in the life video. And that's why today is the day that I will be meeting Chris Jericho and his band Fozzy for the first time ever. And I'm really excited about this. I probably won't be bringing my flip cam, but I will be taking pictures of it and then having a video explaining how I met Chris Jericho and how I felt about meeting him overall and what the experience was like meeting him and I haven't heard any uh, bitching or anything like that from meeting Chris Jericho out of other people and uh, from other videos that I have seen so Chris Jericho seems like a really down to earth guy and someone that everyone would want to meet and he seems really nice too outside of the ring and he's definitely one of my favorite superstars of all time if you want to get my thoughts and opinions on Chris Jericho, one of the best wrestlers in the world, might I add, and uh, you can check that out on Superstar Profile, and check out my previous videos, and I talk about him there with his career highlights and everything, and his goals and as well accomplishments, and uh, this is going to be really exciting, I've been wanting to meet Chris Jericho for a long time, and uh, I've met a few TNA wrestlers, and I haven't really met too much of uh, WWE wrestlers, so this is really cool. And as close as it gets to, and uh, right around getting close to my birthday, which is going to be coming up in September, September 23rd. So, I would consider this as an early birthday gift, and I will be going uh, to Poughkeepsie here, and uh, it is very close to where I am right now for the summer. And uh, I will be actually leaving uh, next week uh, prior to this video, so this is really cool. And uh, I'm not missing this opportunity. And when you get opportunities like this, especially meeting either your favorite wrestler or one of your favorite wrestlers that you grew up watching, you don't want to miss that and you want to take up on that opportunity. So this should be really fun and the countdown is on. I'll probably be wearing either the Rock shirt or I might even wear a Shawn Michaels shirt. I wish I had gotten the Chris Jericho shirt, but unfortunately I don't have one. Otherwise I'll be wearing it. I might uh, get... Uh, of course, his CD sign, and uh, maybe I can find something else that Chris Jericho can sign for me as well. And uh, this should be really fun. I don't really know what I'm going to be telling him just yet. If I do get a chance to talk to him for at least maybe five seconds or something like that, and then get my autograph signing and everything, and then just leave. So it's going to be really fun meeting Chris Jericho. I'll show you guys some pictures uh, after this video, and then giving my official thoughts on what it was like meeting Chris Jericho and was it worth it to me. I'm sure it will be because it is Chris Jericho and who wouldn't want to meet him. And uh, this is going to be hell fun and hopefully you guys will enjoy this. Holy crap. How's it going guys? I'm back at it again in here for the other half of this video. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the pictures that I showed you. Now I was going to be able to try and get this camera that I'm talking to you guys on right now. And probably bring it with me during the meet and greet. However, I know there's going to be some issues with that. And the quality of the camera isn't really far too good. And uh, especially with taking pictures, it wouldn't be able to be shown as good. But with the pictures that I did show you and that I took from my regular camera and a little bit from my cell phone there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it and uh, it really was an awesome time. And I had my mindset on where I was going to be going there and uh, as I was going to get myself there, I had a few things that I was going to talk to about to Chris Jericho, but I hadn't really 
in my mind good enough to where I was going to say good match at SummerSlam and I hope he enjoys his tour and everything but once you go up and meet the guy and to whoever it is that you like you know you have it really good in your mind and once you actually meet them that just goes out the window and I just got really nervous and I was just more happy to actually see him it's not like I was going to pass out or anything I was just more nervous and just really excited and uh, it was really worth it and uh, where I went was that Collector's Realm, uh, it's right here in Poughkeepsie and very close by. And um, I got there around 4.30 and I uh, had some dinner and ate some pizza there. Really good buffalo chicken pizza and um, then right after that I looked in the store too uh, to see what they have. And they have some really cool stuff. There's like uh, really good prices on DVDs there. And they had most of the, of the some of the DVDs that they did have. Some of them that I already do have, and they have some of the Northeast wrestling stuff too, uh, of the past events. And um, I'm sure they're gonna have the upcoming event in September 22nd, which I'm unable to go, and I'll be home by that time for my birthday, which is the following day. So that's not gonna work out as planned, but. Meeting Chris Jericho is well worth it, and he is a really nice guy. Same thing with the rest of the band members too, as well. And uh, he actually came around uh, six. I was there online from five up until around seven, so it took a while to actually meet Chris Jericho. And uh, even though the rain did stop for a while, which is great, and then it didn't pick up again until after I left, which is great there. And uh, where um. Chris Jericho and his bus was trying to get in, but there wasn't enough room, so they went down the street. Chris Jericho and his band actually came out, and he actually posted on Tell. And if I can find that link, I will send a link to you guys and leave that down below in the description box. And he actually touted the fans there getting ready for the meet and greet. And uh, that was really cool. I was able to get the photo up. I was able to get the CD signed by all the band members. And they were all just very nice and some of the nicest people you will ever meet again. So I highly suggest to all you Jericho-holics to go out and meet Chris Jericho there. A lot of his fans there and a lot of Fozzy fans there as well. So that was really cool. And, uh, you know, I was online for a long time, but you forget about that once you meet him. And it was well worth it. And uh, I'm going to show you some things that I did get signed from Chris Jericho. But first, again, with the picture that I was able to get right there. Hopefully, you guys can see that. That should be a good enough view for you guys. So that was awesome. And I was trying to actually contain myself there with all the excitement. So uh, I tried to put on the best smile that I can. So it doesn't really show that I was shaking or really nervous. So once again... There is the picture. And now getting into the stuff that I did get signed from Chris Jericho. Of course the CD was about 20 bucks and I got the VIP pass. So that included with the picture I just showed you. Getting the CD and getting it signed. Meeting Chris Jericho and his band and everyone signed it. And uh, this is just uh, what's happening with the CD. So I'm not really going to show that. But... This is where I got it signed right in there and silver where everyone signed it and there's the actual CD of course one disc so go check it out then the last thing that I did get signed and they were handing out a different amount of pictures of Chris Jericho they had one him coming up to his jacket and they had him with the world championship and I believe him singing with the band and a few other pictures and I came across to the world championship one and I was going to get the one with him coming out to his entrance and with his jacket and everything. I thought that one was cool but I had to get the one with him with the world title. That one is just as awesome and I hope you guys can see the autograph signature somewhere along the bottom over here and uh, that was really awesome that I did get that signed so once again. Uh, just showing it off here with the CD right there. Again, with the picture. And last but not least, with the World Heavyweight Championship right there with Chris Jericho. 
again, very awesome and well worth it to me. And if you guys have a chance to go out and meet Chris Jericho, definitely highly recommend it to you guys. And I do recommend the VIP. And uh, if you're just going to get a regular signing, yeah, that's cool too. But actually being able to take a picture with the band there, and uh, that's really awesome. And uh, doing more than what you would do in a normal signing. And I uh, highly recommend it. Really fun day. Still feeling the effects. So I mean, I was going to do a video that night, last night. But I was able to actually come back home and be able to watch Raw on time. And um, I was trying to actually... Uh, contain myself and watch well and uh, I was almost not going to watch it because it was still that great and uh, I had a really fun time and note that I didn't actually get to see Fozzy perform this was just a regular meet and greet and uh, just to make a, kind of a full day out of it and uh, it just kind of snook up on me even though I was excited throughout the whole day and everything and uh, I don't have any other Fozzy albums so the one that I just showed you is the first one that I do own Maybe in time I'll get a couple of other albums and maybe get to see Fozzy perform wherever they're going to be. Maybe they'll go to North Carolina, whether it be Raleigh, Fayetteville, or within the surrounding area, most likely Fayetteville, which will be easier for me to go to. And uh, yeah, like I said, highly recommend it to you guys. Chris Jericho is definitely an awesome person to meet, one of the nicest guys you'll ever meet. And uh, I met a few TNA wrestlers before. But having Chris Jericho being the first WWE guy that I met, that's really cool and a really great early birthday gift to me before I go home to North Carolina. And uh, I did post the pictures as well on Facebook and Twitter, so I've just been milking it the whole entire time. And uh, I wish most of you guys could have went. I know uh, a lot of Jericho holics on here. I know Canadian Warrior 1995 is one. A uh, few other of the Wrestling for Wings. Crew is also Jericho Holics too as well. That's why I did the pose there for the wrestling for rings. So hopefully you brothers enjoyed that, and the rest of you guys and everyone else watching this video hopefully enjoyed it. And I know I sure enjoyed my time there as well. And uh, maybe I'll get to uh, actually go to one of Fozzie's concerts. That would be awesome. But if I don't, you know it's really cool to see Chris Jericho for the final time before he returns. I know he'll be back. And uh, I'll be back for another video as well. Stay tuned for that. And I'll be having a DVD review on Edge. So be on the lookout for that. That'll be for my special Superstar Profile Look video coming very soon. So with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed this awesome video. And with that being said, have a great day. And I'll talk to you guys whenever the next video will be posted up. And until then, I'll see you guys whenever I see you. Peace.